Hey guys, Vibrion20 back again, and today in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to get every single piece of artwork in Animal Crossing New Horizons. Now, this does take a bit of time traveling, so if you're against some time traveling, then this video may not be for you. But if you're looking to get every single thing in your museum in record time, then this is definitely the best and easiest way to do so. So when Red finally comes to your island, first off, you need to have make sure you have the newest update of the game. And once you see Red for the first time, you talk to him. And then once he comes to your island for the second time, and sometimes this takes weeks. Some people even said they're reporting it takes about a month. It took me about a week and a half or two weeks for him to finally come. But I kept time traveling a day, and then finally you'll know if he's there by accessing your map. Looking at your map, and you'll see he's on your secret beach. So my secret beach is on the far back, and you can see that there's a little symbol there letting you know that Red is there. Now once he's there, keep in mind you will be time traveling back and forth, and he'll have different paintings every time you visit him. A lot of people don't know this, but this is a really quick and easy way to fill up your museum. Now there is a catch and I'll show you and talk about that in just a second. So let's go ahead and go in here so we can get this process going because it's really, really cool. When I discovered this today, I was like, I just have to make a video and share it with you guys. So as you can see, here we are, we're with Red and um, <laughs> we're his favorite cousin, obviously. He's got a ton of paintings for us to choose from. Some of them are probably fake. And as you can see, he's got some rare items here on display as well he says they're rare sometimes they are sometimes they're honestly not so okay so we're gonna go ahead and check out some of these paintings let's go ahead and check out this one here this one's pretty easy to tell if it's fake or not you can tell by the smile if it's like if she's grinning too much or for something with her eyebrows I think let's take a closer look because I don't think I have this one yet we're gonna zoom in and this one uh, it's hard to tell it's I th I want to say this one is real. I think this one is real. Oh god, it's going to I'm going to cringe so bad if this is not real, but I'm pretty sure this one is real sold. I I think it's real. Yeah, I that one looked real to me. Hopefully I don't look like a fool in this video. <laughs> Um, if you guys are wondering if you can tell if they're real or not, you just look up the real painting in real life online and compare the two and there you can pretty much do a spot the difference and pretty much see if it's real or not. So basically since we got our painting, we're going to go ahead and save and quit. So once you find the, the date that red appears on your island, just remember that, uh, save and quit. And then, uh, we're going to go ahead and time travel a day ahead because he does have to mail it to you and it takes 24 hours for him to mail it to you. So you're just going to time travel a day ahead. And then if you don't want to, I guess you can wait a day, but you're not going to be able to go back to get this to, to work. So let's go ahead and go to our main menu here. Time travel a day ahead. Here we go. Boom. See, we're already in the 6th of May because we had a time travel that far to get him to appear at all. Sometimes it takes forever for red to appear. So there we go. We time travel a day ahead just to get our painting. And here we are on the next day. We got Isabel greeting us like always. And right now, um, oh, it's Tank's birthday today. How wonderful. Oh, Tank is going to be in for a big surprise because it's going to be his birthday over and over again this month. Uh, because we're, I'm going to keep doing this trick even after I make this video. Just to, until I get bored, obviously, just to kind of get as many paintings as possible. Because you can rinse and repeat and pretty much fill up your entire museum. So here we go. Um, let's go ahead and check our mailbox. This will be the painting that uh, from Jolly Red here. Go ahead and put that in our pocket and then we will go ahead and uh, head to the museum and see if i'm uh oh wait a minute there's something else let's see oh ursula okay nobody cares ursula nobody cares all right so let's go ahead and get our painting ready here famous painting and what is this one beach ball okay famous painting all right let's go make sure this painting is indeed real hopefully i don't make a fool out of myself and it's real because if not <laughs> i guess i'm going to look stupid but either way at least you'll see that this trick does work because we will go ahead and show you how red will have more paintings <laughs> the very next day so all right let's go in the museum hopefully Bather blathers has good news for us come on blathers don't disappoint yes make a donation and uh let's see if uh let's see if i'm right let's see if i'm right hopefully i am if not that's a famous painting. It's so much more than a famous painting than I could have imagined. Yes, this is definitely real. He would have already freaked out and said it was fake. So there we go. We just got 
That's awesome. So I was right. So it's sometimes on that painting you can tell by her smile. Sometimes it's kind of like an over exaggerated smile. But there you go. Once you donate it to the you know to Blathers, you can go ahead and save and quit again. Save and end. And what we're gonna do now is we're actually gonna go back a day to when Red was there. And he'll be there, and a lot of people probably think, well, he's just going to have the same paintings and statues. That is not the case at all. He'll actually have a complete different inventory, and you can just keep doing this over and over again until, um, you know, you get sick of it or you actually fill up your museum. So here we go. Go back a day where Red was. We're going to go ahead and go back into the game. And uh, he should be there on our secret beach with, uh, with new paintings. And I will go ahead and show you guys just so you guys know this is legit. Okay, guys, here we are. We are uh, on the very, you know, the day before we went ahead and went back a day. And as you can see, let's go ahead and check our map. And he should be there on our secret beach. Yes, he is. You just go back a day because he was there that day. And guys, I'm telling you, sometimes it takes forever for him to show up. So it's really nice to take advantage of this and just go back a day because you know he's going to be there. And then um, he will have different selection for you, believe it or not. I don't know why. I thought Nintendo would have kind of been a little smarter about this and made it to where it was just the same exact paintings that way you can't abuse this but as it stands right now they have not patched this and you can just keep doing this and there'll be different paintings different statues and stuff like that so as you can see we got different stuff here sometimes you'll see a, a painting that was already there could be fake could be real but um nonetheless you will be able to get something different each and every time so there you guys go different paintings different paintings now all i got to do is go ahead and select which painting i think is real buy it go ahead and go forward one day donate it to the museum then go ahead and time travel back a day and rinse and repeat you can keep doing this until your museum is full guys do me a favor smash like if you thought this video was helpful let me know are you going to be doing this yourself or are you going to go ahead and say, no, I'm not doing that because I'm not a dirty cheater like you. But that's pretty much all for right now, guys. And as always, there'll be more to come shortly. Thanks again.